We just launched into a table at Mahjong time. In this strategy theory session, we're going to be playing Hong Kong Mahjong. If you are new to this version, look for links in the video description below so you can learn the fundamentals and also download this player reference which has all the scoring in it. We are playing at a table with a zero point minimum. East win. So any combination mm. will be a winning hand. So Nine dots. you can have three in a sequence or three of a kind. Mixed White suits red. doesn't matter as long as you have four blocks and a pair, you can win. In this case, we have a three Eight, of a four, kind or pung of east win. So that Two, particular carry, carry. block actually has value. It is the wind of the round. Red, so red. we have one fawn with that particular block of one tiles. Dot. The rest of our tiles nine, are nine. We'll chow on that. That's a three in a sequence. Mm. So we're good on that. Let's see, we have a closed weight here, which are more difficult to complete. We have a side weight with a 2-3 as opposed to a closed weight with a 4-6. So Seven characters. I think that was a better discard. So we're one away from ready. East wind. We even have a pair with a 5 crack. Nine characters. There we go. We got Four a 7 dots. crack. We're ready to win on a side weight, 2-3. We need a 1-bam or a 4-bam to win. And this would be one, one fawn. We have no flowers right now. That's another fawn. Nine characters. A fawn, if you don't already know, is a scoring element that has value. North wind. That is not Mahjong. We're looking for a one bam or a four bam to win. Seven dots. One, two, three, four discards. Ready to win and under six discards. That's very good. Seven bands. That's a good goal. Hong Kong Mahjong is a quick game. You yeah. want to try to be ready to win in six discards. Eight bamboos. That is not Mahjong. Two dots. We need a one bam or a four bam to win. Chow. Six bamboos. No. Don't click it. Don't do it. Five characters. No. Chow. South wind. Six crack. No. We don't need it. Six characters. Oh, they got Mahjong. Two fawn, chow hand, and they self-picked. You get a fawn for self-pick. So everybody pays double for self-pick. So really we tied for fourth place. I'm not sure the distribution in a tie situation like that. I think it's arbitrary and random. But that is how you play Hong Kong Mahjong. If you haven't learned yet, Look for a link to fundamentals in the video description below so you can learn how to play. And come and play at Mahjong time. Send me an email. I can send you that 30-day VIP code. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, consider subscribing. Click the little gray bell if you do. That way you'll get notification for when I post new videos. You won't miss an opportunity to learn a new strategy or pick up an insight to the game that could give you an advantage at the table. Between now and the next strategy theory for Hong Kong Mahjong, may all your picks be keepers.